The Pew P crowd coming down Bliss Parade in Belmopan this morning was not overwhelming either in spirit or in numbers. Perhaps typical of this capital city, they seemed dutiful if not totally convincing in their job to generate hype around their slate, led by Pablo Kawich. Well, you only had out there uh, 75 people in your position. It doesn't look like you have a lot of support. Your response? Well, I, I think you need for recount. <laughs> I think you need for recount. Um, just just in, th in terms of campaigners, we have more than that. And we have people who are not presently campaigning out here as well, supporting. Um, as you mentioned, a lot of the, the working class in Belmopan is not able to come out at this point in time. And likewise, they don't truly show any political support when, when the, it's time that they can come out as well, right? So it is a, one of the realities of Belmopan that, that the crowd size will always be different than other municipalities. Kawich and his team went through their nomination process smoothly, with each candidate having the required two nominees. Political basics, and Kawich says that campaigning has been just as easy. Well, the differentiating factor is, is primarily that this team is a working class team. We have professionals on this slate. Uh, I myself have worked in the technology profession for 23 years. Uh, we have uh, varying professions in the, in the, or disciplines in the slate, uh, from, from uh, communications to, to marketing, uh, education, uh, business management. Um, health as well, fitness, right? Um, tourism. So those are t our strengths that we also believe that we have an advantage over the over the opposition. Uh, one of the main selling points with us is the works that we intend to accomplish. That that we we focus on positivity. Are you all facing any voter disillusionment because of what happened in the last council with the mayor? And um, we know. how do you? Explain that to voters and do you have to apologize to them for that? Well, I cannot really apologize for something that I had no control over. Um, when it comes to, to relationships, my leadership is a completely different type of leadership. I understand what you're saying, that you have a different approach to relationships. But at the same time, the voters feel that they were defrauded by the PUP in terms of, well, we vote for a council and work with central government and all we got was endless fighting. How do you make that up with them? Well, regarding the, the present council itself, uh, the voters in Belmopan are not concerned, are not really concerned or, or are not expressing any concern with that uh, in this run after the, the convention itself. Prior to the convention, that topic was a very a uh, hot topic for the residents. After the convention, the mention of the present council has been very, very minimal. And that minimal residual damage is why Kawich says his team will sail to victory. Well, the outcome I, in our view and analysis will be a landslide. Um, that is the feedback we're getting from residents. In terms of John Saldiver, well, in my personal view, I cannot speak for anybody else, his time has come to an end and it's time for the UDP to move on to new uh, candidates.